This is what it is, okay? I said, empty your mind. Be formless, shapeless, like water. Hey, thanks very much for the support of the channel. It's growing like crazy. I really appreciate it. This is my walk from Sisa uh, subway station in Beijing to my Hutan Dojo. Got a little Guangchang Wu going on here. Uh, techno Tai Chi by the grannies. Uh, I was tempted to jump in as I go by. Uh, Hutans are pretty cool. Uh, we'll see in a second. Hey, old grandfather. Love the wife beater. Anyway, crossing across the street, down the alleyway, you'll see the red doors designate courtyard homes uh, on either side of on either side of each wall, right and left. Anyway, down this down the road here and up ahead, take a right, and it looks pretty dreary on the outside, but on the inside they're pretty nice. Typical door entry, typical layout. And this is the inside courtyard of the. Uh, dojo, that's the beautiful Beijing sky, and here we go. How to get off Sankyo in a grappling context. Uh, first, I'll show, look, if it's not sport fighting, you have a lot of options, okay? This is what I'm showing is really if you're more in a kind of grappling scenario and you can't punch, you can't kick, etc. So what I'm going to do to set it up is use human nature um, against it. And that being that people are stubborn monkeys, and if we're pushed, we push back. If we pull, we're pulled back. And so what I'll do is I'll grab, doesn't matter where I grab, sleeve, shoulder, uh, you know, uh, on his elbow, even down at his wrist, yank down very strongly. When he postures up, boom, I go through. You push through from your feet and push your hip through, not just duck your head under. That's very important. Initiate everything very strongly from your feet by pushing into the ground and your head will follow with your hip. Again, yanking down very strongly. I have to get him to act like a non-Aikidoka, a non-Aikido person, uh, so he's not capitulating for me. Yank it down, boom, head under. There's the arm, shoulder, elbow lock that is Sankyo. Uh, wonderfully painful. Uh, of course, you're going to have to do this yourselves. You're going to have to experiment with this. You're going to have to drill it enough that it's really into your system so that you can uh, you execute it when you recognize the opportunity. And then you're going to have to practice either through some more controlled rondori or free practice, free sparring of a sort, or do it in a sports fighting contest. Like if you're doing uh, jiu-jitsu judo, this would be illegal. But if you're doing a jiu-jitsu tournament, you could try something like this, or you're sparring in your BJJ academy, uh, you could do this. You're not going to make many friends doing sankyo on people, but shogunai.